The border between Kyrgyzstan and Tajikistan has been disputed since the dissolution of the Soviet Union in 1991. Periodic small-scale clashes have erupted there over access to land and water between local populations and at times with border guards. During those four days in September 2022, the countries deployed their forces who launched indiscriminate and disproportionate attacks, attacks that could amount to war crimes. The laws of war require Kyrgyzstan and Tajikistan to protect civilians during armed conflict. Human Rights Watch traveled to both sides of the border to piece together what happened. We spoke to witnesses, analyzed satellite imagery, reviewed photos and videos, and built 3D models. <laughs> Yakib Meldikulov, a 55-year-old retiree from Kyrgyzstan, fled his village of Dostuk after hearing news of violence at the border. On the 16th of the morning, we went to the border at 16.30. We went to the border at 1.5 km. We went to the border at 1.5 km. We went to the border at 1.5 km. We went to the border at 1.5 km. We went to the border at 1.5 km. We went to the border at 1.5 km. We went to the border at 1.5 km. We went to the border at 1.5 km. We went to the border at 1.5 km. We went to the border at 1.5 km. Heavy fighting between forces of the two countries broke out. Over the next hours, it spread across multiple locations along the border. Human Rights Watch investigated an attack by Kyrgyz forces near the village of Shobok, where two Tajik ambulances and a vehicle carrying civilians came under fire. The attack killed 10 civilians, including four children and two medical workers, and injured six more. By analyzing the movement of the vehicles, their positions, and the damage they sustained, a 3D model helped us determine that the two ambulances were hit by shots fired from around the Kyrgyz village of Dostuk, about 110 meters away. In a separate incident, the Tajik town of Histavaz was hit by shelling between 7.30 and 8 a.m. 59-year-old Savrineso Hojiboeva was killed and four of her relatives were severely injured when a shell fell inside the family's courtyard in what appears to have been an indiscriminate attack. Heavy fighting continued along the border throughout the day. Tajik forces overwhelmed Kyrgyz forces and took control of multiple Kyrgyz villages. People in civilian clothes speaking Tajik carried out widespread looting under the watch of Tajik forces, while hundreds of homes and other types of civilian infrastructure such as kindergartens, schools and medical facilities were set on fire in what may have been an attempt to clear the area of its population. Some time before 2.30 p.m., Mezakmat Hamidov, a 72-year-old retired man from Kyrgyzstan, was killed in his garden in Boboduk. The village was under the control of Tajik forces at the time. I was in the middle of the night. I was in the middle of the night. I was in the middle of the night. I was in the middle of the night. I was in the middle of the night. I was in the middle of the night. Man, 
Fazvalı kırıp şardı oturdu dedi ki, ki oturken ne ki bir yarım saatte ki kızım telefon aldı. Dadam boyu telefon alıyor dedi, ağzı telefon işleyip dedi, dadam o mu yaptı dedi, o şaka etti. Şimdi de maklamanda bir gürgülüp geldim ben bakıyor. Gelsem, kocayla maler diyordu gene ki, üstüne kimdir yok koy gene ki. PM in the central square in Ofshikalacha, a Tajik town on the border, Kyrgyz forces used a laser-guided bomb with blast fragmentation effects near Tajik forces minutes after they had arrived. Dozens of civilians were also in the square at the time. We used 3D modeling to reconstruct immediate aftermath of the strike, which killed at least 10 civilians and injured 13 others, mostly men who had gathered outside the local mosque after a funeral. We identified the bomb and mapped out the positions of the military vehicles and the civilian victims and found that the attack was disproportionate and apparently indiscriminate. <laughs> Abolo va paska onda zat ma ne meda odamu megut ki tepalang bal balan shud. Zoidbek Dadobekov was outside the entrance of the mosque, about 10 meters from the impact site, when the bomb struck. Yakım ma ne poçken didan ki kum buram dost. Anun poyni poçak, kum fantam boyun çoşi. Ma bu foydi desti ki şimdi ki ma masluk şudan. زندگیم چروک شد من دو مواز خورفتیم من این بچه ها عذاب میکشده کن آیندی بچه ها جای خوندم و کار میکنه ده کن مردی کاری میکنه ده چیزی کار میکنه من این ها اکن زندگی همین ها میفروه لوتنگ و برنگ کنتینیوید این کرگیش ویلیجیز while Tajik forces had control. By the end of the day, they withdrew. Kırgenizde dual kalktır. Dualda hemen kıyı gönderdik gördük da. İçi de hiç neyse kalkanımız. Da birinci kırgındayla oşollar sınır ettiği genimiz atayla kıyı göz gönlünü gördük da. Spesialine kıyı göz gönlünü. من نمیدونم برای چیزه جان کرد چیزه و جان شد این از این چند بار جان شد چیزه فایده میبیند فقط آدم میموند 